Good afternoon children. This is your geography lesson. Today we're going to be looking at compass directions and then looking at symbols that can be found on ordnance survey maps. Your first activity, you're going to have a task sheet that looks similar to this. On your task sheet, you're going to have a grid that has got different places that can be that can be found in a local town. This here, we're going to use our compass to support our learning. Here we've got north, east, south and west. So we've got four points on this compass. We've got directions that, we, that we're going to use to go around the town to find certain places. So the first, the first di uh, direction we've got is from the start, go north four squares, where are you now? So here is start. I'm going to show that north is here. So north is going up. So we need to count four spaces. Now we don't count this as our first, our first starting. This will be number one. So we're going to go one, two, three, four. So we've got post box. I'm just going to make a mark there so we can see that because we're going to our next statement, we're going to start from this point. So the first answer to our first question is post box. So now it says go east three squares. Where are you now? So east is going to the right. So we go start we're on post box. So we're going to go th three squares to the to the east. One, two, three. So our next answer is cafe. The next statement is go south three squares. Where are you now? So south is going down. So we're at the cafe. We're going to go down three squares. One, two, three. So we're now at the beach. And that will be my next answer. From the beach, it's asking us to go west six squares. Where are you now? So west is going to the left. And we've got to go six squares. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we're now at the theme park. And now it says go east two squares. Where are you now? East is going right. One, two. So we're now at the police station. Now, we've got a different statement here, asking us to do something different. So start at the school, how do you get to the taxi rank? So first, what we need to do is we need to find the school. The school is here. So we're going to make a note that the school is there. And it says that we need to go to the taxi rank. And the taxi rank is here. So we got to, we're starting here and we're going up. So the direction for going up is north so we we're going to start we're going to use the statement that what they've got here to help us so we, the first part is we're going to put go north so we know we're going to go north but how many squares do we go so we started at school one two so go north two squares And the last one is give directions from the dentist to a toy shop. So again, we're going to find the dentist, which is here. And we've got the toy shop, which is here. We've got to go up. And as we said before, up means we're going north. So we use the same principle, go north. And we count how many steps, how many squares we go up. One, two, three. Go north, three squares. Now on your activity sheet, you're going to be given an eight points of a compass. Now eight points is quite uh, quite easy. Your compass will look similar to this, but here you're going to have different, some different directions. You've got north, here is northeast. Because it's between north and east, this direction is northeast. Here we've got another point. Now this direction is between south and east. So this one is called southeast. Now, we always start, when we, when we have these smaller compass directions, we always start with either north or south as our first direction point. So here we've got south and west. So this is going to be southwest. And between here, west and north, but we're going to start with north, northwest. 
Now, if your task asks you to go, go, three, uh, go, go northeast three squares, if you were to start here, you're going to go in this direction, in a diagonal direction. Obviously here, one, two, three, we wouldn't find anywhere. So make sure that you're following the, di the diagonal path that the compass is telling you to go to. That's your task one. Your task two is an activity where it's going to be more of having a go yourself and you're going to be matching symbols to the name of that symbol. There isn't a video that's going to support you here, but what I'd like you to do is try to make an educated guess onto matching the name to the picture. One has already been done for you, but there should be some clues in the pictures that we have to link you to some of the some of the phrases that match with that symbol. Once you've had a go, then use the internet to help you find the uh, find the answers. There are answers at the bottom of the page, but that is for your parents to help you to mark to help mark your work for you at the end of the end of the uh, work. Best of luck.